Certified most accurate. Now your first Warren 5 forecast. A good Friday afternoon in Michigan. Meteorologist John Gross here with your first Warren 5 update. Let's go ahead and talk temperatures and where we go for this afternoon. Look to be a little bit more of a mild day for your Friday as we continue on here. It looks like mid to upper 30s will be common. That's pretty much right where we should be for this time of year. Enjoy some sunshine. We'll have a few more clouds moving in as we continue on into the second half of today. So let's go ahead and show you that here on the model. Hour by hour forecast as we're going uh, past lunch time into your Friday afternoon. It looks like we'll generally see a slow increase in the cloud cover as we uh, get into the evening hours and then again into the overnight period tonight. And well, let's go ahead and talk about your weekend as we get into the day on Saturday. Now there still will be a very small chance for a shower or two looking to be very isolated and I think most will stay dry and you noticed right there as we get closer to lunchtime on Saturday. There also could be a few breaks in the cloud cover, so we'll call it partly to mostly cloudy as we go into the day tomorrow. Temperatures, I think that's going to be the bigger story. We're going to be cruising through the 40s. Looks like we'll be reaching the 50s easily by the time we reach the second half of your Saturday. Now as we get late into Saturday night, early Sunday morning, this looks to be our best chance for some rain shower development. Anyway, you see some of those yellows, oranges on the map could be a moderate pocket of rain. Depending on how much instability we also have in the atmosphere could be talking about a few rumbles of thunder possible. So again, that better chance for the rain shower activity going to be early Sunday morning. Most of that gone and out of here by Sunday afternoon. Now there will be another system we have to keep an eye on as we go into next week on Monday. And depending on how the weekend system plays out, it's going to be very key on how we see uh, as we go into the day on Monday. But there will be a chance. It does look like many data outputs and model outputs are showing that we could pick up on a little bit of snow as we get into the day on Monday. Still a little too early to talk details and totals, but we should have a much better idea on that as we're going throughout your weekend, so stay tuned to that. Let's enjoy your Friday. Here it is for Midland. We've got numbers back into the mid to upper 30s, increasing clouds today, but definitely some filtered sunshine for the first half of your afternoon. 28 with a little bit more cloud cover as we go into the overnight period tonight. Some big takeaways for your weekend. We're in the 50s both days, partly to mostly cloudy as we get into the day tomorrow on Saturday. There could be a shower or two at best chance for some showers late Saturday into Sunday. Something else that we'll also have to watch is an increase in the winds, especially as we get into the day on Sunday. Could be talking about wind gusts near 40 plus miles per hour. And then as we go into the second half of Sunday, we'll be seeing falling temperatures and that's going to support that chance for a little bit of snow as we get into the day on Monday. So a lot going on here for your weekend. Overall, there it is into the next seven. We're dry for the rest of today. 50s for the weekend, windy on Sunday. Chances for snow on Monday, but a little bit brighter and mild as we get into next week. Stay with WNEM TV5 on air, on the go and online for more news and weather updates.